Welcome back to MN Digital. Today, we're launching an exciting new series focused entirely on Comfy UI, an advanced interface for AI driven image generation and manipulation. If you ever had the desire to create impressive AI images, 3D models, or videos within Comfy UI, but were limited by hardware, this tutorial is perfect for you. In this video, we'll harness the power of Google Colab and specialized notebooks to overcome hardware limitations. Resources and links to Google Colab and the pre-made Python notebook are available in the description. You won't need to write any Python code as I've prepared everything for you. Ensure you have Google Drive enabled, which is entirely free and easy to set up with your Google account. Let's briefly address how Comfy UI differs from traditional image generation tools like ChatGPT's built-in generator. While GPT-4 provides quick, text-based image generation suitable for basic tasks, Comfy UI offers a robust, node-based visual workflow for precise control and customization, ideal for complex professional-grade projects. <laughs> Step 1. Preparing Google Colab. Start by clicking the provided Google Colab link from the video description. Ensure you're logged into your Google account in the upper right corner to access Google Drive seamlessly. Verify that your Google Drive has sufficient storage space. Remember, the default 15 GB should handle smaller projects, but complex workflows might require upgrading your storage. Step 2. Configuring the Colab environment. Now, set your runtime environment. Click the arrow next to the connect button at the top right. Select change runtime type. Set the hardware accelerator to T4 GPU and hit save. Click connect. You'll see details of your allocated resources, system RAM, GPU RAM, and disk space. Free Colab accounts allow usage for up to three hours and 40 minutes per session. If you need extended time for substantial workflows, consider upgrading to Colab Pro. Step three, saving to Google Drive. Next, click Copy to Drive on the Colab page. Rename the copied file to something clear, such as Comfy UI Google Colab. This step is crucial for enabling future edits to your notebook without restrictions. Step four, installing Comfy UI. Now we install Comfy UI. Press the installation button in the Colab notebook. Allow permissions for Colab to access your Google Drive. The installation will execute, creating a folder named Comfy UI in your Google Drive. Once complete, you'll receive a URL link that provides direct access to the Comfy UI interface. Click this link to verify your installation. Step 5 Running Comfy UI and Manager. After installation, Launch Comfy UI by clicking the provided button again. Confirm successful startup by checking for the confirmation message indicating the interface URL is ready. The Comfy UI Manager, an integral tool for managing dependencies and custom nodes, also automatically installs, streamlining your workflow setup. Step six, troubleshooting and resource. Setup. Attempting a prompt might initially result in an error indicating a missing checkpoint or resource. Don't worry. Let's resolve this by downloading the required resources. Go back to the notebook and stop the currently running process. Execute the provided commands to download essential checkpoints, like the popular Dream Shaper model. Once the download is complete, rerun Comfy UI. Step 7 Verifying Workflow. Now, retry your prompt. You should see the resource checkpoint recognized and loaded successfully. Run your workflow and confirm that everything is operating smoothly by observing your first generated image result. Closing and next steps. Congratulations. You've successfully set up Comfy UI on Google Colab. This setup opens endless possibilities for sophisticated AI-driven visual workflows. Stay tuned to our channel, MN Digital, as we delve deeper into advanced Comfy UI techniques in upcoming episodes. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay informed about new tutorials and professional marketing insights. See you in the next video.